the South Korean film pilot doesn't quite succeed in delivering its drag comedy. From the very first drag scene, the artificiality was hard to ignore. The camera and its stark objectivity makes it clear that what we are seeing is simply a drag performance, highlighting how challenging this genre can be to pull off convincingly. That said, Cho Jung Sok, who gained recognition for his comedic role in Architecture 101, is far from a bad actor. In fact, he's well suited for the role. Having played the lead in a stage production of Hedwig and the Angry Inch years prior, he puts in a great deal of effort to make his character's female disguise believable. But ultimately, I didn't buy into the idea that his character could realistically fool those around him. I often found myself wanting to shout, He still looks like a man, people! The film begins by setting up Cho's character, Jong Woo, as a once-celebrated pilot. He's a well-known public figure after appearing at a local TV talk show. But his rising star quickly crashes after an unfortunate incident at a company drinking event. Following an insensitive remark about his female colleagues, someone records and leaks the comment, turning him into one of the most disliked figures in the country. As a result of the scandal, Jung Woo is quickly fired, and unsurprisingly, no other airline is willing to hire him. To make matters worse, his wife, who has grown tired of being neglected, leaves him and takes their young son with her. Left with no other option, Jung Woo moves to a small apartment he had originally bought for his mother and younger sister. His mother is rarely around due to a personal hobby, while his sister, Jung Mi, is busy promoting her makeup skills online. When a drunken Jung Woo impulsively decides to apply for a job as a woman, Jung Mi becomes an invaluable help. What happens next is highly predictable. Jung Woo is both surprised and thrilled to find that his female disguise works better than he expected, although I find it a bit too unconvincing. As Jung Mi, he manages to get hired largely because the female head executive of his former airline is looking to recruit more female pilots. Along the way, he inadvertently catches the eye of one of his former colleagues and begins to bond with a female pilot named Shul Ki, which complicates things further when Jung Woo starts developing feelings for her. The film, which is based on the Swedish comedy Cockpit, naturally delivers a string of absurd moments as Jung Woo tries to maintain his female persona in front of those around him. However, many of these scenes feel contrived and heavily reminiscent of other iconic drag comedy. Tootsie immediately comes to mind. And then there's even a sequence that feels similar to one in Mrs. Doubtfire. Unfortunately, the movie lacks the sharp wit and humor of these classics, relying instead on silly gags and jokes centered around the protagonist's disguise. The film attempts to address several gender issues as Jung Woo navigates life as Jung Ming, but despite its good intentions, the execution is clumsy at best and muddled at worst. While Jung Woo learns valuable lessons about how men like him can be insensitive and rude to women, it doesn't change the uncomfortable reality that he essentially takes a job meant for a woman. In terms of his relationship with Sul Ki, the movie thankfully avoids pushing them into a conventional romance. But it also seems unsure of how to handle their growing bond. This confusion only deepens when Sul Ki is revealed to have a significant issue of her own. Additionally, much of the supporting cast is underutilized, despite their best efforts to bring life to their flat roles. Lee Ju Myung adds some personality to her otherwise thankless part, while Ha Sun Hwa and Oh Min A inject energy into their more colorful supporting characters. It's unfortunate, however, that the film doesn't take the full advantage of their comedic talent. Overall, Pilot falls short in delivering consistent laughs. While it didn't work for me, it might resonate more with viewers who can embrace the lead character's female disguise better than I did. But hey, I'll leave it to you to decide if this mildly entertaining flick is worth your time. Thank you very much for watching the whole video. And if you have a movie or TV show that you want us to cover, just comment it down below. We'll make a video of it in the future. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out our playlist for more recaps.